more of a mixture of going in and out of the groove and intensifying the groove by adding little things in between, you know, versus just like a whole spaz. For me personally, I, I try to keep conscious of that. You know? So explain maybe uh, the difference because the question has come up before. Uh, you're talking about a chop and some of the younger students think, is he talking about a rudiment? Mm -hmm. uh, or how are you defining that? A chop is literally whatever you decide it for it to be, honestly. You know, because, because of tempo and feel and placement, you can make anything a chop. You know, you can add a double stroke on one time in the middle of a groove and it's gonna feel like a chop because it's an insertion of, of just a punctuation, musical punctuation. A chop that people say that they really, really love to see me play is this, uh, it's a groove. It's actually really just a groove. It's a Lenny, it's originally, I learned it from Lenny White and Dennis Chambers. And it just, it's, uh, yeah, it's just. And then to just put, you could put a time roll. And then go back to the groove. That whole phrase is technically a chop, you know. Four strokes on your, on your toms, double kick on your bass drum and back into the groove, that whole phrase would technically be a chop. So, and I'll show it to you just by changing the tempo. Nice. Yeah.